Good morning, dear hearts. We are at lesson 242. Um, this section, our special guiding thought is what is the world? Um, and today, today what the world is, is where I'm choosing to leave. I'm choosing today to give this day to God. It says, this day is God's, it is my gift to him. That is our lesson. And the lesson starts out that I will not leave my life alone today. Of course, there are very many previous lessons that we can see how they play and they meld together to bring this message home to us and for it to be even more poignant and on point that we understand it even better. Um, and it says, I do not understand the world. And so to try to lead my life alone must be but foolishness. We've had the lessons, of course, that I am sustained by the love of God. Lesson number 50, and such a profound lesson. And that is very much what this is. I am sustained by the love of God. I am not sustained by this world. And I don't have to try to navigate this world by myself. So giving this day to God is my gift to him. And what I am giving to him is I am giving him back my mind and all of my thoughts because there is one who knows what is best for me. And I realize I'm not that. It is not me that knows. Go back into lesson 155. I will step back and let him lead the way because the one who leads the way is the one who knows what is best for me. And he is glad to make no choices for me, but the ones that lead to God. I give this day to him for I would not delay my coming home and it is he who knows the way to God. I walk with God now in perfect holiness when I step back and let the one who knows lead the way. Um, there is a lesson further on in part two of the workbook that says I merely follow for I would not lead. I would not lead. I, I don't really know where I'm going. I've proven that to myself by being in this world and now realizing that this world is the thought of separation and it does not offer me anything of sustaining happiness. So when I have that realization, when it finally comes to me, then I am giving this day and every other day back to God. So the prayer today says, and so we give today to you. We come with holy open minds we do not ask for anything that we may think we want because we don't know what we want. Everything that we have tried out, thinking that this is what I want and this is what will bring me happiness has always, <laughs> has always ended up um, disappoint me, disappointing me. It has always gone down in flames, let's say. That's really what I was thinking. So everything that I've thought I have wanted in the past has just gone down in flames. So I'm not going to ask for anything now. Instead, give us what you would have received by us. You know all our desires and our wants, and you will give us everything we need in helping us to find the way to you. Again, I will step back. I will let you, the one who knows, lead the way, and that will bring me the greatest joy and happiness today as I give back to God all of my thoughts and my mind that it may be made clear for me what is real and this world is not. That's it for today. I hope this helped. Um, I, I hope you are enjoying these part two of the, the workbook sections. Uh, please like, please share, please subscribe. Please be here tomorrow. Please, please comment. Namaste.